Hi, welcome to a screencast on task 1.2. This now um, just builds upon uh, the information that you've written up on task 1.1. So this now focuses on uh, breaking down the skills and the behaviours that you've been taught in task 1.1. So um, you don't really need to reinvent the wheel here. So you could um, use the five skills um, that are from the previous pages or um, you can choose any of the skills that we've looked at in class and add them into the, the first column here and then just really sort of it's, it's the moderator wants to see that you can apply it to different um, situations and environments so um, let's say you looked at the first skill of communication in what environment um, and how could you use this um, or could this skill be used? So thinking about, for example, it could be in sports or it could be in class or it could be um, in the session that you're um, planning and, and taking forward or an events uh, planning um, when you'll be looking at um, running a tournament. So um, anything that you can include there, that'd be great. And, and, and how can you use that skill so think about why communication is important in that particular environment and what positive effect could um, using the skill have on your employability and success in work so why is communication obviously important you can link it maybe to um, being successful in a job application or um, interview skills or even on you know whether it be a telephone interview or um, a one-to-one -one interview um, all of those things I think are very important when it comes to um, showing that you can apply it to a work situation or if you're in a meeting for example communication is important if you're leading a team so all of those things there you need to make sure that you filled out in terms of skills and then for behaviors exactly the same thing so I'd look at, uh, back at page six and seven um, look at some of the associated skills um, sorry not skills associated behaviors um, that are attached to the skills on page six and seven add them in here and again sort of apply them to the different environments but also uh, to um, how they will be useful um, towards your success in work and in employability um, so that really then covers um, the section of uh, 1.1 and 1.2 looking at skills and behaviors and it just shows the moderator that you can apply those behaviors and those skills and, and recognize the importance um, in employability in the future and which environment uh, and situation you can perhaps use them in so um, good luck with that hopefully it won't take you too long um, but uh, yeah just make sure you get that all filled out great